Hey everyone, it's Nell from Marblog, and I am gonna do the two month update for my newborn. Is she still a newborn? She's asleep right now. Let's see. There she is. Oh, she's so big. She's grown in the past two months. She's grown super big. I remember seeing her. Uh, in my husband's arms, and his hands are big, and now he really can't even hold her with one arm anymore. He still can, but you can definitely see her growth. Um, so I just wrote down some topics, or like the yeah topics to go over. Her weight, I haven't weighed her. We haven't taken her back to the doctor. Um, she is set to go back um, this week. So I'll I'll update y'all on her weight. I'm thinking she's like 11 and a half pounds or something. Definitely over 10 pounds by now. Um, her length, I'm guessing like 28 inches. She was born at 22, and her weight at birth was uh, 7.9 pounds. Um, her feeding, and sorry if you hear noise in the background. My laptop is like really running really uh, loud. Um, her feeding, um, this week or this past weekend was really off her regular schedule. Um, we left the hospital on with a really good schedule and it had kept up for the first like, two months now. Um, every three hours, 3, 6, 9, 12, 3, 6, 9, 12. But now she's sleeping a little bit longer, still in the morning hours, like before noon. Um, and she she'll be awake for a good hour, once or twice a day. But that's affecting her feeding because, like for example, this morning she had her last bottle. Um, at 3 o'clock, but then she woke up at 5 to to eat, and she had 2 ounces at 5. Then she woke up at 6.30 and had another 2 ounces. Six seven, eight. And then she woke up at 9, and she only had an ounce. And then she didn't wake up again until 1.30 or something like that. So that has been happening for the past 2 or 3 days. Um, her sleeping, I just talked about it. I forgot where I left off. My husband came in. Uh, sleeping, oh yeah. She's just, like I mentioned, yeah, take it to the sink. She, um, is sleeping about four hours during the morning hours before noon. And then other than that, she's sleeping for two to three hours. Um all the way up until like 3 o'clock in the morning. Uh, and my husband and I are still doing the switch off. Um, I'll wake up at 6.30. Sometimes uh, he will have fed her around 5 o'clock like I mentioned earlier. Um, so when I wake up, I'll just get my girls ready for school, drop them off, then when I come back, she'll usually be waking up so that I can feed her again, and then I uh, feed her uh, all the way through the day, and then my husband will take over when I go to bed at around, it used to be like 9 or 10 o'clock, but now it's like 11 or 12 o'clock, um, and then he'll go to sleep at her last feeding around 3 in the morning. Um, her, oh yeah, um, and with her sleeping, she has always, I don't, I don't know if I mentioned it before, she has always slept, um, oops, I didn't need to do that, always, um, smiles in her sleep, and even laughs, it's super cute, my husband think it, used to think it was creepy, but it's just adorable now, and she has, I think I did mention it first, she has a dimple on one side of her cheek, just like her daddy, super cute, um, and I swear, that she smiled um, while we were playing one day in bed. 
um, she like reacted with a smile. Um, and I sing her the ABCs every morning um, with a bunch of other nursery rhymes, but I was singing her the ABCs and I swear she smiled back at me because she's pr she probably already knows the song. Um, her hair, it's grown probably like a quarter to half an inch already and it's still super soft um, and I'm taking her a bath still once a week she's due for a bath tomorrow and her nails I've started having to cut them twice a week now instead of once a week um, and they're growing super fast so that's good it means she's eating good um, and I have your teeth she does not have teeth, but my husband swears that she does. We went to a party yesterday, and he's like, Baby, she has teeth. I'm like, No, she does not. I haven't talked about it or checked, but whatever. He said, um, his mom said that he's, he developed super fast when he was a baby, so he expects her to, to be ahead of her developmental uh, milestones also. And he got teeth like at six months or something like that, or four months. Yeah, I think that's four months. Um, no more newborn clothes. She is, yeah, her her toes when she stretches out her little feet, the her onesies, her sleepers, yeah, they don't fit her anymore. Um, I think she's even cried a few times because she'll bend her legs, and then when she stretches them back out, she can't stretch all the way because her her toes are snagged um, in the buttons or something like that. So, this week I'm going to be taking out her newborn clothes. Oh, so heartbreaking. And I think my sister just bought her. Uh, she came to visit this weekend for my grandma's anniversary party. And she brought her some clothes. So, i got to go through that and check to see what she can wear. We went to Bell's yesterday because my grandma gave me a coupon for $10 off any $40 purchase. And I think it came out to like $37, something like that or 27, I don't remember, um, but we bought her mostly, uh, three to six months, right, three to six, yeah, and then some 12 months clothes, because they had tons of sales on the summer clothing, so we stocked up on that, um, and then, <laughs> she's moving, um, Clothes. Oh yeah, and then I showed you uh, earlier her swing. We got that from a friend of mine. Um, before that, she had just been in her boppy or wrapped in um, our sugar sweet baby wrap, um, which I love. It's like my favorite wrap. I have we have two mobies, a sling, and another. Oh, and a ring swing, which I haven't even used. Um, I've been uh, going to my Sugar Sweet Baby Wrap all the time. We went to a party yesterday, and um, when we're out and about, it's nice and thin and stretchy, but it holds her in really good. It has a good reinforcement um, strap for her. <laughs> She's playing with her tongue. Um... So yeah, that's my go-to wrap. I'll put the link so you can check out her Facebook page below on her website. Huh? You want a snack? Yeah. She just got back from therapy, so I usually give her a snack afterwards. Oh, she's sweating. Can you see her sweat? Uh, and that is pretty much it. The girls are wonderful with her. They're very helpful. Um, only thing I gotta work on with them is putting their laundry away. And... Um, I'm trying to get them to help me. No, no, the other way. No, push it. Yeah, there you go. Um, help me put their laundry away and fold socks. <laughs> They're always low on socks. Um, and that's, well, that's all I have on my list. I'm trying to think of anything else. Uh, her poops and pees have been really good. Um, yes. Yeah, it's off. You don't need it on. And that's it. So I'll see y'all for next month's update. Bye.